students walk out of school in support of a classmate they believe was suspended for standing up against a bully. Well, we're asking the school the tough questions about that punishment. Welcome to Coin 6 News at 4 o'clock. I'm Jenny Hansen. And I'm Dan Tilkin. You know, that uh, student story has received thousands of likes on a community Facebook page. Today, Amy Frazier went to the Rainier School District for answers. And Amy, you've learned a lot more about this. Yeah, I can tell you things got pretty heated here at the high school today as students decided to take action against bullying and protesting the student's suspension. However, the district tells me that suspension is warranted. Dozens of students walked out of class today in support of 18-year-old Nate Taylor, suspended from Rainier High School for two days. I was very frustrated because somebody's life was on the line. Nate says he went to a counselor and the principal on May 22nd expressing concerns that a friend was being bullied. Nothing was done so I went back to him and he told me the exact same thing to stay out of it because I have nothing to do with it. With his parents permission 15 year old Dylan Lane also spoke with us today showing us a picture he says another student posted of him on Instagram and the disturbing comments below it. He told me to go kill myself. Nate says he was worried it was something his friend might do, and he says that's why he went to school officials three times in the same day. Did you get upset? Did you get angry? Absolutely. I was pretty intense. I was very intense about the whole situation because somebody close to you losing their lives, not just taking their lives. I don't ever want to feel that. I found out the superintendent is out of state today, but I reached him on his cell phone to find out more. Was the student suspended for being a whistleblower on bullying? No. You know, uh, we can't discuss specifics of a student case, um, but we can assure you that we have never suspended a student who has come to warn us about the safety or advocate for on behalf of a fellow student or friend. Now, Nate's father allowed the school to give us his son's discipline file. We received that information late this afternoon. In that file, it says that Nate was suspended for the language he used with staff and for impeding the investigation, something that Nate denies. The superintendent tells me that there is a discipline hearing next week for the students involved in this bullying investigation. All that being said, I had a ton of students and angry parents coming up to me today. They say that bullying is a huge issue at the high school here, and they say the district needs to do more to respond and to stop it. Reporting live in Rainier, Amy Frazier, Coin 6 News. So many things we didn't have to worry about as kids with the social media. Thank you, Amy.